Hello everybody, this is Tech Stack here and welcome to the first edition of How to Kill Your Friends in FTB. Um, what you're about to see is a demonstration of the trap itself. Um, so let's get right to it. Uh, oh, someone's broken my ME system. Instant death. <laughs> Okay, so I've got these things shut off. Um, the way this really works is the ME transition planes are really what's the working force behind this. Um, you can see as I place blocks here, they just eat the blocks that are on top of them when they are powered by the ME system itself. Um, and to disable them, obviously, the cable gets broken. That's how we uh, disable them for this uh, setup to work. When the cable's replaced, they get powered, they turn on, they eat the blocks in front of these high-energy pellet launchers and the higher energy pellet launchers are turned on um, by the fact that uh, down here in this setup we have transition planes that um, suck in the torches that are down here which enable these torches to turn on and power these things so that's the real basic behind it um, it's nothing very hard to set up at all um, get away from it so th because of the sound uh, it's nothing hard to set up really you just have to get into their base break one cable um, and then do some wiring underground to uh, some cable underground and set up a lot of transition planes. The transition planes are probably pretty expensive for this, but it's one of those jokes that you just don't see very often. It's totally silent. There's really no indication that it's happened, um, especially if they have an underground base. You know, I did this as an above ground base, so it's a little easier to see this uh, setup. But if this were an underground base, you could bury this completely um, off to the side of their base. Um, and default mode like I had it here, you really can't tell that it's even there. The uh, normal wall that they have up is enough to, uh, to do it here. That's how you kill your friends in FTB with the ME system. 